Okay guys, so check this out. Beyonce has apparently offended several Kenyan musicians after they were omitted from the Lion King The Gift album. According to an interview with TMZ, John Katana, the frontman of Chaka Cha, Kenyan band The Mushrooms, noticed the multi-platinum selling superstar didn't include any local artists on the project, which has been dubbed a love letter to Africa. No one called us, Katana says in a video call. We just read about it in the media just like everyone else. There's been a big debate on social media about that, Kenya missing out on The Lion King. The creatives in the country are complaining that Kenyan ad if not them mushrooms, should have been on Beyonce's recording because the phrase was made popular from Kenya. So everybody feels that Kenya should have had a piece of the pie, but that's not the case. So yes, we should have been on the album. Disney reportedly tapped Nigerian pop star Wizkid, Ghanaian producer Shada Whale, Nigerian singer Burner Boy, South African artist Busiswa and Moonchild Sinelli, Nigerian stars Techno, Yemi Alade, and Mr. Easy for the album, but still excluded Kenyans. Last year, a petition began to circulate calling for Disney to drop its trademark over Akuna Matata, a common Swahili phrase Katana says they popularized in their 80s platinum hit Jamba Buana. So what do you guys think? Do they have a point? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to HipHopDX.com.